now dear student we are going to discuss question number 2.9 and in this question it is given to you explain what would happen if capacitor given in xs 2.8 a 3 mm thick mica sheet of dielectric constant 6 were inserted between the plates clear so now dear student first we will take values of next uh, previous question so it is given to you area is given 6 into 10 to the power minus 3 clear and supply is given to you 100 volt so we can write like this area this is 6 into uh, 6 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter square and voltage is given to you 100 volt clear okay and distance between plate is also given to you this is 3 mm in previous question clear so can we calculate value of capacitance again yes c is given by epsilon naught a by d clear epsilon naught we have 8.85 into 10 to the power minus 12 multiply area area is given 6 into 10 to the power minus 3 divided by value of d value of d this is 3 into 10 to the power minus 3 this one and this one cancelled out and this is 2 times clear from here you can see this is 17.7 into 10 to the power minus 12 uh, we can see because this is a capacitance so this is farad yes or no so this is value of capacitance now in this question it is given if we insert a mica sheet having thickness 3 mm between parallel plate capacitor so now you can say let's suppose this is a parallel plate capacitor we introduce here a thick mica sheet and this is 3 mm this is given to you clear so what will happen when we introduce it and in part number a if we discuss part number a voltage supply remain connected listen carefully so when voltage supply remain connected it means we can say potential difference across this plate that does not change it and what will having effect on a charge uh, or capacitance so we can see c dish because dielectric inserted so this becomes k times of c yes value of k is given to you 6 so 6 into 17.7 into 10 to the power minus 12 clear from here if you multiply you can see we have 2 4 we have 6 and we have uh, 4 so we can say this is 106.2 clear into 10 to the power minus 12 and this is farad clear so new value of capacitance becomes this much amount clear to you okay now this is value of q but is there any uh, is there any change in the value of charge on a parallel plate capacitor yes we can say q dash this is equal to c dash into v yes or no value of c dash now becomes 106.2 into 10 to the power minus 12 multiply 100 clear to you clear so we can see this is equal to 106.2 into 10 to the power minus 10 coulomb clear it means we can say when this battery remain connected potential remains same but value of capacitance increases and value of charge this is also increases clear to everyone yes or no yes now what will happen when supply is disconnected it means in this is for the part a clear now we are going to discuss part number b so for part b now what we are doing we are disconnecting this supply clear at the time you can say if we insert any dielectric plate between parallel plate capacitor we can say its capacitance increases yes its value becomes this one clear to you and what about the charges because we have already disconnected a battery it means charge on this uh, parallel plate capacitor this remains same why because we can say this plate actually behave just like an isolated plate clear so we can see value of charge remains same but what will happen on a potential yes now you can say whenever we insert a dielectric slab between parallel plate capacitor electric field net electric field decreases yes or no or we can say e dash equal to e by k clear and we know there is a relation between electric field and potential difference so we can also write like this v dash equal to v by k it means we can say potential difference is decreases by k times clear it means we can say this is 100 by 6 so we can say this is 16.66 uh, volt clear so we can say now final potential difference this becomes 16.66 volt clear to everyone so this is all about this question clear